Bonjour, mon petit chef Fla, Amber here, and Happy New Year! It's 2016. Can you believe that? <sighs> so, being that it's 2016, I thought I'd take a second to share with you guys my, I would say New Year's resolutions, but I didn't really make any resolutions this year, it's just mainly things I want to do. So, my 2016 bucket list. Um, the first thing I guess you could call, call a resolution, but I'd rather just call it a lifestyle change. Um, as of the first, I have been, I haven't had meat, uh, so I'm, I'm vegetarian now, so that's fun. Um, it's been a week, which is seven days longer than I thought it would last. Anyway, on to the bucket list. The first two are actually things that were on my summer bucket list that I didn't do. Um, and the first one is to get my first tattoo, and that will actually be happen happening sooner than later. Um... I'm in the process with Salisha of planning that whole thing out. The design itself is planned out. It's just we're currently finding a tattoo artist to do it within a reasonable price range. So perhaps by the next video that will be a thing. And the second thing is to dye my hair. I've been planning to dye my hair lilac for like 15 years it feels like. Um, and just things keep getting in the way. But that will hopefully be happening soon. The next thing is something you can definitely helped me with and it is I want to hit a at least a thousand subscribers by the end of 2016 so if you have not done so already please subscribe and if you have already subscribed hi I love you also make all your friends and parents and neighbors and pets subscribe thank you have a nice day <laughs> the next thing is actually a really big thing I want to do this year and it's to travel more and I have trips planned that I, not planned, but trips that I want to take this year. It's just a matter of making it happen. And actually there's another goal that I want, that I need to tie in with that and that's to get my passport. So the trips I want to do, I want to go to Chicago this year for the Once Upon a Time convention. I'm such a nerd. I want to go to New Orleans to see the 1975. Yes, I could go to Brooklyn and I probably will end up going to Brooklyn. But I am down for a road trip. I want to go to New Orleans just because. So, and also pit tickets for that show are cheaper than the ones of Brooklyn. So there's that. Um, I have been preparing and planning to go on a trip with Contiki Tours. If you have not heard of them, I'll leave the link. And they do really cool trips for people in my uh, my age group, like 18 through I think 35 is the age group. And I actually like. I'm trying to get a group of friends to go with me. It's the trip, the first trip I'm going to go on is 10 days in England and Scotland, so that's exciting. Also, I've been sort of invited by my aunt to go with them to Dubai and South Africa, which are two places on my travel bucket list. Um, two places I want to go so bad, and I'm so glad she invited me because my mom won't go with me to either places. How rude is that? I also want to go to Disney World. I've never been. I know. I've never been to Disney World. For someone who's so obsessed with Disney, I've never been to Disney World. So that's a thing that hopefully will happen this year. That and Hawaii. <laughs> the next is a, actually another travel goal. I want to go to Firefly Festival this year. Um, I've wanted to go for a few years now. It's in Delaware, which is like 10 minutes from where I live. Um, I wanted to go last year so bad. Paul McCartney was there, but I didn't go. So, so. But the 1975 we're playing this year. A lot of other people that I really like are playing. I think Ellie Goulding's going to be there. Or is that Coachella? Either way, whatever. I want to go to Coachella too, but that's probably not going to happen. I want to get my license this year. That's a big one. Mainly so I can road trip uh, across the country, uh, following bands on tour. That sounded a lot creepier than it should have. I meant like going to multiple dates on concert tours, not like stalking people. This year I would like to get my book published. If you didn't know, I wrote a book or I'm writing a book. It's almost finished. I'm actually writing two right now. Um, but the first one that I was writing in November for NaNoWriMo, uh, I would like to get that. Hopefully that will be finished and published by the end of 2016. Next, there are a bunch of people that I hope to meet this year. Um, Maddie Healy. Uh, and the rest of 1975. I've kind of met two of them, that's why I didn't list all of them. And uh, that was an awful, awful incident. 
Don't make whale noises at your favorite band, guys. Anyway, I'd love to meet Maddie. I want to meet Halsey. I saw her this year, but I didn't get to meet her. I want to meet my little baby Troy this year. I know he's going to be in Philly, I think, next month or is it March? Soon-ish. Um, I want to meet Louise, Sprinkle Glitter, who I absolutely love. I want to meet Joe Sugg again, and I want to meet Zoe. Um, and I want to meet the Coney Jolies, because I love them. They're just the cutest little family, and I just want to hug all of them. <laughs> I guess this is a bucket. This is a goal of 2016. I'm telling you now. I'm going to post more, more covers in 2016. I want to post more covers. That's when I initially made you t my, this channel. That's what that was for. So I I actually recorded one already. I just have to film the video for it. So that'll be up soon. And I also have another one I'm planning out. So I got two ready, sort of, almost, kind of. And the last thing um, on my bucket list, I want to see more Broadway musicals, specifically Lion King, Wicked, and Les Mis, which are my top three favorite musicals, even though I've never seen any of them live. Um, the King and I, it's mainly for my mother, <laughs> uh, and Aladdin. I want to see those all on Broadway. Um, so hopefully that'll happen. I've been trying to see The Lion King for 10 years, apparently. I didn't realize it's been out for 10 years, but I've been trying to see it on Broadway for 10 years. Um, so those are my plans, basically, for my bucket list, things I want to do in 2016. What are your resolutions or just things you want to do, get accomplished by the end of 2016? Let me know down there in the comments. Um, I'd really like to see what my peeps are up to. My peeps. Anyway, if you like this video, <coughs> sorry, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like me, feel free to subscribe. All my places are down there, um, so you can follow me and we can be buds, and I'll see you soon. Happy New Year!